Hi friends, how are you? Today we will learn how to read the bottom plate drawing of an API 650 storage tank. Bottom plates can be classified according to the slope, cone up and cone down. There are flat bottoms also as there, but flat bottoms are not usually recommended for large diameter tanks. Another classification is, an romal bottom plate and a bottom plate with annular plates. The difference between the two is, on a normal bottom plate, the bottom shell will sit on a fillet weld, and the joint configuration may be not smooth. Annular plate joints will provide a flat weld face. Let us check, what type of bottom plate is ours. First, we will have a general study of the drawing. Annular plate outer radius is 12 meter 557 millimeters, bottom plate radius is 11 meter 847 millimeters, nominal shell radius is 12 meter 500 millimeters. The lap between the annular and the bottom plate is 50 millimeters. The slope towards the center is 2% of the radius of the tank. Divide the radius of the tank by 100 and multiply the result with 2, you will get the slope of the tank. Seventy five millimeters lap. This is the longitudinal lap between the two individual bottom plates. See, the center of the annular plate comes on zero degree of the foundation. What is typical E? E is a typical overlap joint detail of three lapped plates. This is achieved by fullering method, normally, heating is not acceptable. Detail D is also, achieved by the same method. Have a look at the section detail, AA. This detail shows the thickness, weld details, and the overlap detail. Note that the joint is welded from one side only. What is section BB? It shows the tank bottom shell position. Annular plate projection towards outside the tank from the bottom of the shell is 50 millimeters. Shell to annular plate welding is 10 millimeters fillet from both sides of the shell plate. The bottom plate positioned below the annular plate and overlapped by 50 millimeters. Section CC. This is the weld joint detail between two annular plates. The detail shows this is a sight weld. See the back strip. A back strip is given where the back welding is difficult or impossible. Go to the material list.
Item number B1. Bottom plate. Quantity 13 numbers. Thickness 8 millimeters. Width is 2 meters and length is 8 meters. Item number B1. Bottom plate. Quantity 13 numbers. Thickness 8 millimeters. Width is 2 meters and length is 8 meters. Now the most important thing. The material. People sometimes makes mistake when they choose the correct grade material. Before marking, make sure the material grade is as per the drawing. Here, all the bottom plates are grade A, 36M, and the annular plate material is a 573 grade 70. Have a look at the bottom plates. Thirteen numbers, full plates required. The individual bottom plates comes touching with the annular plates are called sketch plates. Usually, sketch plates are not square or rectangle. AE1 annular plates. See the details. I think I have covered all the details necessary before starting the fabrication. For how to fabricate the bottom and annular plates in details, please watch my previous videos. I hope you like this video. Please comment and suggest other topics. Thank you. Good day.